Hey guys, we're back here with Rob Edwards, and he is the uh, Community Service Director out of the uh, Missoula Asian Services, and you're here to talk about Medicare, Medicare. D Part D, and Medicare uh, Advantage. Correct. Right? Correct. Yeah. October 15th through December 7th is Medicare open enrollment time every year. And it's time for people to take a look at what their Medicare Part D and Medicare Advantage programs and plans are looking like and uh, take a look and see if they can save some money or if they should be investing in a different plan. Cool. And we were talking about this a little bit earlier about uh, some people who don't sign up for uh, these programs uh, as they become of age, basically. Sure. So when people turn 65, they have the opportunity to join Medicare. And Medicare is an optional piece that you sign up for when you are ready to. If you have other coverage, it may be in your best interest or may not be in your best interest. The piece of it that gets important is that if people don't sign up for Part D and don't have creditable coverage, they can end up paying a penalty later in life when they do decide to sign up. So it's important to get in and, and take the new to Medicare class, which is offered 12 months a year at Missoula Aging Services, when you're getting ready to sign up for Medicare. And then once again, in October to December, take a look every year at your Part D plan. And if you're on a Medicare Advantage plan, it's very important to sign up and look at it again. Cool. And the uh, two workshops that are coming up this year, at the end, towards the end of this year, of course, are November 12th and uh, December 6th. And it caps off about 25 people. I, that number, it's going to depend on demand. It really does. It really does. Yeah. So it's one of the ways that we can help people sign up and get their plans checked. So the first thing to do is to call Missoula Aging Services. You'll get our call center. Uh, it's manned uh, between 8 and 5 every day. Mm -hmm. And what they'll do is they'll take your information and send out a letter to you to get some information on what drugs you're taking, what Medicare plan you're on, and all that. You return that plan to us. We have some volunteers who go through, enter your drugs onto the plan finder, and find out, well, are you better off with a different plan than you're currently on? If you're good to go, they'll send you a letter saying, hey, just stay where you're at and you're good. If not, they'll call and let you know that it's time to schedule an appointment and we can either schedule an appointment one-on-one -on -one with you or you can come to one of our open enrollment classes and sign up that yep. way. Because the biggest thing that I wanted to harp on is that this is a, a financially saving opportunity for a lot of people and uh, with Medicare and it's like um, a lot of people are spending way too, way more money than they could be which is why Medicare uh, plant Part D and all this stuff could also help them as they transition. Absolutely. So every year, Medicare plans, Medicare Part D plans will change their formulary. So they'll change what drugs they cover at what tier and they'll change what the costs are. Uh, if you sign up, stay with where you're at and one of your drugs drops off formulary or something else happens to the plan that makes it different, you can end up paying an awful lot of money. We saved uh, our seniors uh, about $522,000 last year. Wow. Just with Part D and Medicare Advantage savings. And those are savings that if they hadn't come in and looked at the plans, they wouldn't have saved. So it's, it can be a pretty significant uh, funding source and can yeah. help cover some other costs. Yeah. yeah, it's like if you're wondering why one of your uh, um, pills are costing maybe like, like, like 30, 40 bucks a pill. You know, there's some medications out there that are very expensive, and while we don't give any medical advice, what we can do is identify the drugs that are costing yes. the money, and maybe suggest that they talk to their provider about whether or not this is the one they need to be on, or if there's a lesser cost. No medical advice, but we can sure help no. them with finances. Yes, it's all about financing and uh, the right kind of medication for the right finances. It's not about saying I was like, oh, you should be taking this blood, uh, this. Um, blood pressure medicine rather no. than blood medicine. We're not telling no. you what you should take and what you shouldn't take. We're just telling you is that these are the uh, medication that are covered under Medicare. Correct. Under your particular plan. Every plan, every, every provider has a different plan. And we're just trying to make sure we find the right one for you. Yeah. And it also depends on what pharmacy you go to. Yep. So you may be able to see that, okay, if I go to pharmacy A, my cost is going to be this. If I go to pharmacy B, it's going to be different. It makes a difference depending on the plan. Yep. So it's a good thing just to come in, uh, have this work done, take a look at it. If you're good to go, we don't recommend any change. You don't need to do anything. don't even need to come in. Uh, but if there is a change that should be made that could save you some money, we really suggest you come on in and, and set up an appointment. Give our call center a call. Uh, manned live now. We've got four people manning that uh, all the time, and they're very knowledgeable, and they can certainly help you get set up. Cool. And the number is 728-7682. Correct. Um, Missoula Agent Services um, number, but you can always go online to MissoulaAgentServices.org. So what can people expect when they go into these workshops? So the workshops are going to be uh, 
uh, a setup on the campus of UM. They'll have some computer labs set up so that people can actually be setting themselves up and signing themselves up and doing some plan checking themselves. And we'll have some volunteers and some staff walking around helping them with that piece. So it's a little less one-on-one, -on -one, a little more of a group setting. What it does is it lets us get to more people because we just don't have enough time in the day to get to all the people and make appointments for the people that we need to. So just a couple of options of ways to get help. And uh, we're trying to help as many people as we can. And we really encourage that people, no matter what they what they're doing or if they think their plan's the best, take a look every year because it can change and it can save you a significant amount of money. Yep. And speaking of change, they only have so much uh, time to actually change their plan, right? They do. Open enrollment is only between October 15th and December 7th every year. A little bit different with Medicare Advantage, which is a plan that replaces uh, traditional Medicare that some people are signed up. That can go on a little longer depending on whether or not their plan has changed, but we really suggest you get in at that point. At least give our staff a call. Find out when your deadline is. Uh, some plans are going away. Some plans are staying. Just get that information. Give us a call. We've got very well trained, very smart staff that are really good at this stuff. Yep, and there's a lot of information. And if you want to learn more, again, MissoulaAgentServices.org, and you can call them at 728-7682. Again, that number is 728-7682. Is Great. there anything else you want to say? You know, just uh, really suggest everybody, regardless of what you think your plan is good for you, give us a call. Let's, let us take a look. Let's uh, get through there so we can save you a little bit of money. That can either be a little extra spending money in your pocket or for some of these people who are living on a fixed income, it can be a definite help. So give us a call. All right. Well, thank you very much for joining me, Rob. I really appreciate it. Great. Thanks for having us. Yeah.